Hello everyone, this is Aki Magneto and uh, today I'm going to be teaching you how to design an e-commerce website using HTML from scratch and uh, the major difference on this video is that I'm going to be using the uh, custom bootstrap theme now what I mean by this is that I've made the bootstrap as in I've made a customized setup in such a way that you don't need to worry yourself about the CSS or the JavaScript or any other stuff so I'll give you a link where to download all you need to download for this tutorial so now this is a full e-commerce website and in this video I'm going to be showing you just the front end alone meaning I'm going to be showing you how to add PHP later so now let's have a quick view to what we're about to do now we have uh, this is the website we're about to design from scratch now as you can see the name of the website is called Maxtor. it's a website I wish to sell headphones i wish to sell um uh, uh, mp4 players or mp5 players the site i wish to sell headphones mp4 players and uh, power banks so now as you can see the design it's um, very creamy it looks modernized it has a logo clear logo from here we have logo here we have a search box and we have a drop down i can show you more categories about this site we have this that will um, this you know, that will take you to now we have some links here special offers delivery contact we have the cart and this is a carousel that means a sliding image now this is part of a new trend that we can see in most e-commerce website now uh, if you click once you click here it changes the slide so I had it just two slides alone so now right now we let's move straight down to what we have now we have a sidebar we have the future product we have the product in stocks we have exclusive deals by the side and also we have uh, the footer whereby we have the you know the quick links the our offers we have accounts we have social media and we have the name which is a um, magneto store so right now um, the reason why I'm showing you this is just to show you the final product of what we are trying to design from scratch now therefore let's go straight back to what we have now the next time I'm going to be taking you through is that I'm going to take you through how to code with HTML I'll teach you how to style with my custom made bootstrap team and I will show you a good offer of where you can get the best and the best hosting for $20.75 on the website that is that has almost 99.99% uptime that means the servers are always on the files you put there are always secured and you are and you have unlimited resources like the bandwidth the disk space is huge and other stuff like that now I'm going to teach you how to add interactivity but later in this video I'm going to be teaching you how to add how to code with HTML now later I'm going to teach you how to add payment integrator using stripe PayPal to check out or any other process now the way I'm going to be doing this is that whenever if you want me to add, if you have any issue with any um, uh, payment processor that you want to integrate into your own, um, uh, 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 you know, you want to integrate into your own e-commerce website, you can go under this video and comment and tell me the name of the payment processor you want to use. Then I will download the uh, documentation on how to integrate that, and I will do that for you as a tutorial. So as for everyone to learn the new trend in designing e-commerce website now this course is strictly unrepresent mine so please your f please feel free to ask questions drop your comments subscribe follow more and please share the video now the next thing I'm going to take you to is to auto divine auto design the management aspect what that means is that I'm going to teach you how to design an admin interface on how to manage orders and how to manage or uh, uh, orders mirrors and other stuff like that now let's move straight to now for this video for you to be able to get the max daughter and 17 team uh, the bootstrap team because um, I've uploaded the uh, file so if you want to download the file you can kindly visit the link below that means this link which is uh, akimagneto.com.ng slash download files so kindly go to the um, website to download yours and uh, after you've downloaded yours then or you can send me a mail to aki at akimagneto.com then i'm gonna be um i'm gonna reply you back with uh, the 
five in the box it's just uh, one point uh, eight eight MB so don't worry I'm gonna be sending you the file or you can call my number I'm, I'm in Nigerian so you can call my number but remember it is not toll free that means that you'll be charged based on the call so I prefer you send me a mail or you can go to my website to get the uh, 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 the files now let's move straight to uh, this now since the file is mine hundred percent that means I'm the one that designed the website Akim Magneto you can do the following to the files you can change the colors if you want you can change the layout if you want you can re-edit it you can resell you can publish without editing you can remove my magneto store footer I don't care and many more things you want to do under the practice of freedom so as you want just do it the way you like it is Akim Magneto's property so you can do just this to it 100% now as you have known that we already have what we have to work with I believe by now you must have downloaded the uh, 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 the file now the design now this frame we are, we are looking at right now talks about uh, why I decide to uh, 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 you know to you know, the file you just downloaded the reason why I decide to make it a customized theme is that is to reduce stress now I've uh, made my research into latest design trend of 2017 I think it has been on since last year since bootstrap came into existence though some years back now the, uh, the major thing the major design trend in HTML programming is that uh, you have to reduce the stress that means that there are some CSS formatting because if you download the bootstrap if you download the bootstrap from the bootstrap website you will see the CSS file already inside you will see the JavaScript already inside you will see fonts and also you will see JavaScript also like that so now you should know that bootstrap contains all these files and they work now the way they work is that you 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 make a call on the HTML file so as for you to be able to use them and it's very convenient for you to use I can bet it with you I reduce the stress and I've done all the CSS formatting in the customized made theme so you can download the bootstrap files in the file I sent to you now what I'm expecting you is to launch the index.html using your desired or text editor and follow me as I design the e-commerce website and also and also for those of you who want to change the color change the codes change everything change the way it behaves change that and change this I'm going to show you where and how to do that don't worry okay just follow me as I'm moving now the next thing I'm going to show you here right now it's um, now there is the, the offer I promised to show to you so that you get what you need to um, or you know uh, to host the website because in this course I'm also going to show you how to host the website for just 20.75 US dollars and now so please kindly go to this website and check now to get the offer you can see where my cursor is here right now now the name of the company is Namecheap so they are the, um, for me they are the best web hosting company they had 99.99 percent almost 100 percent so you can give them a round of applause for this now they had 99.99 uptime in 2015 2016 and presently they are still you know maintaining the trend now to get the hosting the total hosting cost for the first year is going to cost you 20.75 cents 20.75 cents 20 dollars 75 cents so you can convert that to your currency wherever we are watching this video maybe to pounds maybe to uh, south african rounds maybe to sephars i don't care now but the link to get to that is um https this this affiliate name chip this kindly please this is my affiliate link to name chip kindly go to this link and purchase yours and you will never regret it i can assure you of that now the next thing is that i've all uh, in my previous videos i showed you the easiest way to understand programming either in html or php or any other programming language is to draw out a wireframe now you using the wireframe it creates a solid understanding of how the design behaves or how the design will look if you are designing the front end of a web website 
if you are drink if you are trying to do any interactivity with php and any stuff like that now if you look straight to the website we have already and look straight to the wireframe we have we, i call this wireframe this is what i use for my clients most of my clients this is to show them how how it will show how it will display how it will you know how it will behave and so and so forth now let's kindly look straight to this now we have the front one here called the header we have the second one here the carousel that means they have been arranged but they are now the line you here you can see is the total screen size that means the website is kind of full so now we on the header we have 30 sections like let's go straight to uh, you can see this is the header and now if you trace it down to uh, to this to the wireframe you can see it looks the same we have the logo search box and the navigation menus now you can see this depict what i'm trying to say now the next thing that follows is the carousel carousel is this big image that scrolls automatically it's been programmed to scroll that is one of the power that you can see or you can find in the uh, HTML bootstraps like that. Now the next thing you can see is the sidebar. Now if you scroll down to the main web website, you will see a carousel here, scrolling automatically. Or I mean, as I'm clicking, it responds. Now I use this to display the featured product, and uh, we have more. You can control these later. Don't worry. Now we have this as just a side view of what you have in your cart. We have this. It is responsive. Once you click it it drops down this it has a name don't worry you can see it are all these are responsive and uh, if you look through it you can see this we have another sidebar here likewise this one two three now this is the first one this exclusive deal second one the payment method is the third one